I find the story out of this world. So the YouTube fam, the Anazala, are hiring a Dubai-based in-house entrepreneur. So the Anazala family posted their uh, search for a startup founder on LinkedIn who is a passionate entrepreneur, always ready to uh, discuss new projects and launch new ventures. It's an on-site job in Dubai and all the applications are going to be reviewed. And on the LinkedIn post, the job description reads, the Anazalia family is looking for an entrepreneur in-house to initiate and lead new business ventures. Ultimately, the job is to expand and launch new projects, work with other leaders to grow your ventures and help the organization meet its goals. So the family has more than 4.95 million subscribers and it's viral for its just endearing videos. Um, so two years ago, they blew up on the internet as well for their gender reveal for their second baby, which was on the Burj Khalifa. Mm-hmm. Internet went wild. Um, and amongst the founder that they're looking for, they're also looking for a country manager and assisting marketing manager as well. That is so interesting. That is so a many really thoughts. quirky one, isn't it? It really, really is a quirky one. There's a lot of questions. A, if The family's coming up with a business idea. Mm. Aren't they the founders? But regardless, isn't there a founding father in the family anyway? Mm. You know, like... Founding father, like the like father. The, yeah. yeah. Founding family. Yeah, yeah like the original <laughs> family. It? Yeah. Yeah. That And then like, so it's an in-house founder. Make it make sense. Does this mean that the founder can use your fridge? <laughs> Do they get their own separate room? You know, like a little gazebo at the back, so maybe of the house. So that means he lives with them. He yeah, she lives it's with like them. an in-house nanny, but a founder instead. Uh, okay. It's a complicated one. There's so That's many questions in- unanswered. Why would they search for an in-house? Why not just like a part-time, like how normal people... And why wouldn't they just like build on the idea themselves if they're the initial founders? No, but like, you know? I don't understand the point of in-house. It's like he's just. I don't understand the point of a founder. She, like they're just there on their beck and call. Like yeah, it's like me saying, "Hey, Simran, I'm gonna hire you to found found this company for me. I want you to grow tomatoes." But like you've already I came started up, the company. Yeah, I yeah. just came up with the idea. <laughs> Why are you the founder? I don't get it. I don't yeah. get it. It literally feels like an in-house nanny, but for the parents. This is professional <laughs> aspect, you know? Yeah, that makes sense. A professional aspect. Yeah. yeah. Good you didn't stop at for the parents. <laughs> yeah. Nanny for the parents. Yeah. On a professional matter. That's so funny. But I guess people have just like, a, I don't know, very unique wants and needs. They know how to go viral. And requirements. Yeah, actually, that's so true. They know exactly what they're doing. <laughs> PR geniuses, mm-hmm. I tell you. Marketing geniuses.